300 to second place and 200 to 30. See all the cars and trucks when they come out of the racetrack? They have a trailer attached to the cars. And you see different paraphernalia on the trailers. The paraphernalia can get knocked off. But if the trailer gets disconnected from the car, that car is out. Technically not scored anymore. I almost got hit by a piece of luggage last race. Our infield announcer, Tom Gillum, almost got hit by a piece of luggage last race. That's the first time since your wife was throwing luggage at you on the front lawn trying to get rid of you. So we show six cars. Only four have showed up so far. Give you the lineup I have right now. Starting on the pole, Slade to be the number 93, Michael Shatley out of Whittier, sponsored by Ron's Auto Body, Lightning Notary, and West Coast Physicians. Outside of him, it's supposed to be Richard Shatley out of Colton in the number 91 car. Indeed, it is. Row number two, it's the 10T. That's Brent Wayland. And outside Brent, the number six, Rob Malthop Jr. And I think we're waiting for Rob because he was just in the last race. Sponsored by Clutch and Coffee, Tavern Grill, and Steel Logistics. Rounding out the field, the number 88, Tom Steel. And the number one, if he can make the call, he was also in the last race, Christopher Kennett. So probably taking a couple extra seconds, get their cars hooked up or get their trailers hooked up to the cars in the pit area. Another reminder, no smoking or vaping in the grandstands. Cause somebody's serious about this deal. Look at that boat. That's the good old days. Tom Gillum's getting out of the way. The other competitors. Because if you do, they stop getting scored. They can stay out on the racetrack. Well, there goes the sofa. The easy chair fell off the 88 already. And the number one has the cushions off the sofa. He's got the whole sofa. And he's got the boat behind him. Here we go. 12 lap figure eight trailer race, we go green. And the guy who won the last race out front, Michael Shatley. Look out, look out, missed the boat. Malthop running in second, third spot, it's Whalen. Now Malthop trying to go to the inside. Shally trying to beat him back to the corner. Let's see if Malthop tries to knock his trailer off. They're coming up on the boat. Boat still, boat still riding on top of that sofa. Somebody lost a trailer. That is and is out. That's the other Shatley car. Got to tell you, with that sofa under the number one and that boat being dragged behind, that car corners like a beauty. I think he's going to win. 88 is out. I don't care who wins. Uh-oh. <laughs> that's, that's not the place you want to stop in a figure eight race. Shatley clobbered the wall in turn number two that time. Johnny, you there? He's out of the air. The boat's gonna get hit. Malthop, oh, look at Malthop's trailer. Hey Steve, he doesn't have a fire in there, does he? No, it's just a Okay. Oh, the boat got clipped. Boat got clipped a little from Wayland. How many laps down we got? Five. Five laps down, seven to go. Now 
Now Whalen splits the two leaders. He's running in third. Right now, that's a guaranteed $200 for the 10T. Huh? And we're going to go red. We want to get that driver out of that number one car. Actually, six this time by. Tom Gilm was telling me, I think he said the 93 car, the hood is starting to come up on it. Yeah. Sugar Hill Gang, man. First official rap song ever. Different rap than you listen to today. Boat got clipped again. Don't kill it. We need it for the next race. Malthop now coming up on the lap car of Whalen. Look at Whalen still got all that junk stuck on the trailer. Walthop trying to take the long way around. If Whalen takes him out, he would increase his prize money by $100. While he holds him up, here comes Shatley for the lead. 93 now challenging for the lead. They're behind the lap van of Whalen. SUV. Look out! They're hooked together. <laughs> Whalen heads out to San Jacinto. Shatley's going to spin Moth up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get it, gear, and go. Now the one of the 10 T is he's on the lead lap. <laughs> they got separated. <laughs> Malthop should take the checkered flag this time by. Let's see. And he does. The win goes to Malthop. Second spot's going to be Shatley, and third spot will go to Whalen. $500 to the winner. Well, it's kind of quiet. I think that one was pretty darn exciting. Raise the roof for these guys right now if you like that. Now the <laughs> hey, Tom, get out of the way. Look at the hood on the 93 now. Aren't you getting a little, hang on, hang on, he's going to blow a hip getting out of his car. Turn around here. We talk about this all the time. Oh, Aren't yeah. you getting a little too old for oh, this? Oh, hell no. No, let's keep going, man. I got a lot, of, I got a lot of fuel left in me. It was, it was pretty wild. You guys put on a pretty dang good oh, yeah. race. That, it was good. The tin car slapping around. That trailer, you told me once that that's made to do exactly what it's supposed to do, and that thing's going through the S turns while you're going straight. <laughs> it's good. That's a good trailer. I, got, I bought that from Jesse Gordon. That dude's a good man. That's a good trailer. That's a great win, man. Here's it. Put Thank on you guys, it. You guys have a nice. It was a good show, wasn't it? Woo! So I know this is a whole family gig for you, right? Yeah. So who's helping you out tonight, as always? Uh, well, it's just me tonight. My daughter's racing factory stocks now. She, I know. I saw her the other night. Yeah. Uh, my nephew's selling his car, so just me. Keep and and you have you, you get 500 bucks, so I'll come yeah, see yeah. you after the pitch, man. That's right. <laughs> See, you know how this goes. Take your picture. That's right. Get the check. Just get ready for the next one. Yeah, yeah. All right. Here's our first place winner. Oh, man. Another not-so-spring chick. But didn't we have this talk where you guys should park closer to the old guy? <laughs> Almost had him. Almost. Yeah, we'll put the bumper on him, see if we can get him. But uh, he got it, so we'll let it have this one. I don't know. It was pretty tangled up there for a while. Yeah, we were stuck, and uh, I got lucky. Got off of him. He just got going a little bit quicker. You guys took your time and made assessed the situation. No, you guys just <laughs> slammed it. We just went for it. Everything we got. Trailer yeah. hung on, so it'll run another race. Yeah, we'll bring it back and do it again next. What next month? Or next month when it's a little warmer. Yeah, we will. 
So, so who's helping you out with this gig again on Saturday night? I got to thank uh, West Coast Physicians and my mother-in-law with her little business she's got. And then uh, I got Ron's Auto Body and Paint out of Whittier. And then I also have Lightning uh, Notary. Okay, so you're really not getting much from the body and paint guy. But is your mother-in-law here tonight? No, no, she's not. We're still working on getting her out here. But maybe with a couple more wins like this, she'll be back. You got money. Take her to the Sizzler. <laughs> there you go. Sizzler it is. <laughs> There's our second place guy. Hang on. It's one of the new players down here. I'm telling you. Man. What the fuck is he doing out there? <laughs> Good to see you. Almost? Almost. Almost got her. Uh, she's she's not running all cylinders right now. So she's no nobody could tell. Yeah, it's it's definitely chugging on me right now. So but we're gonna see if she blows up in the main event. <laughs> That's what they want to see. A nice ball of flame down the front straightaway would get you a big round of applause. Oh, well, I'm going to go for it. She burns, she burns, baby. That's what these people want to see. All right. So you got the rest of the clan in the back helping you out? Yeah. We're going to go check her out and see what's going on. But if not, hopefully there's a big old ball of fire. That's what we're looking for. There you go, Scott. These guys are not playing with full decks down here. I tell you. Take your picture, you can put it on the wall. Oh, I gotta take a picture. You gotta take a picture.